What's up, Vlog Union? I'm Chris Star. I'm Nate's Vlog. And welcome to Versus, where one guy and one girl battle it out on a topic of your choice. Today's topic, friends of the opposite sex. If we had to pick which is worse, girls having guy friends and guys having girlfriends, it's definitely the men. You guys cannot have female friends because you either want to bang them all or they're going to want to bang you to make someone jealous. That's it. Just about every woman I know has slept with at least one of their guy friends with the option to sleep with just about all of them. Then you guys lie to us about it and try to mislead us. You say stuff like, who, Gary? No, me and him never dated. He's fun. He's like a brother. Then we eventually find out that you had sex with them. I don't know about you, but where I come from, we don't bone our siblings. Us women are emotional creatures. We know how to control our urges, but dudes on the other hand, physical beasts. They want to just hump anything, and I mean anything, that comes their way and grazes their crotch. So you're saying women are emotional and they know how to control their urges? I'm going to go ahead and call bullshit on that. No one's ever saw a woman getting emotional and said, you know what, she seems like she has complete control over her urges right now. What we do say is, hey, could you please stop keying my car or telling people on Facebook that I have AIDS? I just didn't want to be with you, I'm sorry. You know why? Because women are vindictive, evil people. That coupled with their feelings and their guy friends, terrible combination. All it takes is a good fight and some of those emotions that you guys are famous for, and a woman is boning her ugliest guy friend just to spite you. Guys are the pursuers. They're used to rejection. If an opportunity arises, then I'm pretty sure that's not the only thing that will be. Let's say you and this walking vagina bestie are going out, getting white girl wasted, and she just starts flirting with you, touching you, just rubbing all up on you and stuff. I mean, really, what are you gonna do? She's your type in everything, okay? And she's throwing the cootie cat at you like seven different kinds of smoke. You're not gonna try to take a stab at that? Of course not. We only have eyes for you. Don't be ridiculous. Besides, if a guy has any female friends that he would like to see naked, typically we do that before we get into a serious relationship. Chances are if we're still friends with a female that we tried to bone, we got shot down in friend zone. So we probably won't be getting any vaginal surprises while in a relationship. Good. You just brought me to another point. Some women love that competition shit and I hate those bitches. She friend zoned you before because she saw that nobody wanted your ass, but now that you have a girlfriend, you now become more desirable to her. Guarantee you that that hoe is thinking he wanted to smash before, so he'll want to do it now even though he has a girlfriend and I wonder if I can actually steal someone else's man. That's what's going through her head. At the end of it all, she just wants to know that she is the better woman out there and can beat out every other chick. What about when your guy friends like you and they use every opportunity they get to sabotage our relationship from the inside? And they get a lot of opportunities because you go to them with our problems. They always say stuff like, you need a real man, one who's wearing a black and gray and white flannel and a Raiders hat, someone you're possibly friends with, maybe someone you're talking to right now, I don't know. They're always trying to get you drunk. Hey girl, don't worry, I'll take you home. Well, I don't trust that motherfucker. Only guy friend you need in your life is me. And I guess you could have a friend in Jesus too, if that's your thing. Well, that does it for this episode of Versus. Don't forget to like this video, subscribe to Vlog Union, and check out the other links in the description box. Thanks for watching. Thinking you can come home whenever the hell you want, like your dolomite or something, and then we have to pimp slap your ass back to reality when you get home. I don't play that disrespect shit. Women are way worse. Every last one of your friends thinks they're Dr. Laura because they read an issue of Cosmo or they try to.